Hello guys, I'm Minsan and we're back in Anime Last Stand. So this time guys, we can evolve our The Pride Noon into The Pride The One. Yeah, so after grinding for how many days guys? Yes, at last. So by the way guys, look at that here. Yes, yeah, so this is my Pride Noon. Look at my back. It's too bright for real. And then how we get, okay, Pride Noon guys. So to get Pride Noon, yes, look at that here. Bam, you need The Pride Night or Epic right yes that you can get in banner and then yes this full day axe guys you can get this one in story mode hug town axe 6 yes as you can see here and then for fire essence guys you can get that in elemental caverns cavern of fire okay so this is how you get guys the fried noon so before we evolve our pride noon guys into the one yes let's showcase my pride noon overlord okay guys let's go so by the way guys, my fried noon got A, yes, S in damage, S, S in range, and S minus in SPA. And then this is his skill tree guys. Yes, look at that guys, SPA. There guys, so this is the skill tree that I choose for my Escanor or fried noon. Okay, so yep. So let's go guys, again, let's showcase Pride Noon, Overlord. He's using AOE line guys, and then you need 2k for placement, and then for initial damage guys, he got a 821k and then 186 flame damage. And then 26 range and 4.3 SPA guys. And then he is a ground type on placement. Okay guys, let's go for the next upgrade. It's gonna be Cruel Sun. So let's go. Bam. So this time guys, yes, he changed into a AOA circle, a big one. And a total damage of 2.17M and 2.60M flame damage and then 29.6 range and 4.99 SPA and then this time guys he became a hybrid in upgrade 3 okay so let's go for the next upgrade guys it's gonna be solar impact so let's go bam yes this time guys he changed into full AOE look at that and a total damage of 4.5 and 5.4 M flame damage and 37.1 range and 6.6 .6 SPA guys yes look at that guys and then let's go for the next upgrade bam yeah so this is his final upgrade guys and a total damage of 5.29 M and 6.35 M flame damage and then 40 range and 6.3 SPA. So by the way guys, if you don't have Overlord, you can place 2 Pride Noon. And a total cost guys of 86.2k. So yep, so this is your Pride Noon guys. So let's go and evolve him now into a Godly. Yes, okay guys. So to evolve him guys, you need the Helix of Pride. Okay, so where you can get that guys, you can get that here in the Bind Crafter. So yep, here guys, so you need the Glyph of Pride and the Empty Helix guys. For the Empty Helix guys, so here, so you need 25 Mythic Shard guys. Yes, uh, what? Ecor Bial and this 50 Cosmic Essence guys. Okay, so for, M for Ecor Bial guys, you need this Empty Bial. Infinite bosses have a 1% chance guys to drop their Ecor or Icor automatically filling this Bial. Okay, inventory limit 1 only guys. Okay, so yes, you need 10 Mythic Shard. And then next, we need this Glyph of Pride. Yes, you can get this one guys doing quests here guys. Permanent and then Godly Trials. You need to do all of these quests guys. Yes. And then you can get one glip of pride. Also, oh, I already uh, done with these guys. So here, where is it? So here, guys. So with that, guys, we can evolve, yes, our pride noon into the one. Okay, so let's go, guys. So pride of helix. So empty helix. So here. So okay right now i got uh 49 cosmic essence guys so i'm gonna crop another one bam okay so let's go so we got all the materials guys so let's go bam empty helix and then 
Let's go guys and get the Helix of Fried. Bam. Okay, so let's go. So I already got guys the Helix of Fried. Here we go guys. Bam. Ooh, the one. Okay, the one. Nice one. Okay, so look at that guys. So let's go guys. I'm gonna equip him. Oh, the cosmetics guys. Oh my god, look at that, the cosmetics. So OP. Nice. It's really good. Okay, so although my face is quite covered guys. Okay, but never mind. So let's go guys. Oh, back to level 1. I need to level up him first into level 85 before we showcase him. Okay, so let's go guys. 10 years later. Okay guys, we are now done max leveling our the one. So as you can see, he got a plus 20% team damage. And then the skill tree guys, yes, I already maxed it already. Yes, still the same. Yes, look at that. So guys, let's go guys and showcase the one fried with Overlord. He's using big AOE circle guys and then you need 3.75k for placement and then as you can see guys he is a hybrid on placement yes before guys in fried danun he is not a hybrid on placement he is a ground type but this time he is a hybrid so he is really good guys and then for initial damage guys he got a 4.10m and 4.9m flame damage to OP and then 387 range guys 4.3 SPA and then by the way his passive guys called sunlight is very OP yes he can accumulate 10% damage and 3% range every wave without being placed and then the max limit is 150% damage and 45 range. That is OP, guys. Yes. And then, of course, his team damage. Yes, that it gives 20% team damage to all units. So, you must get him, guys. Okay, guys. So, let's go, guys. For the next upgrade, it's gonna be Pride Pool Rat. So, let's go. Bam. Okay. So, same AOE circle, guys. And a total damage of 10.8M and 13M flame damage. 43 range and 4.99 SPA. And then for the next upgrade, guys, it's gonna be Solar Crash. So let's go. Bam. Okay, so this time, guys, he changed into a pool AOE. Look at that. Bam. And a total damage of 22.5M and 27M flame damage. And then 53.7 range and 6.6 SPA, guys. Okay, so let's go for the next upgrade. It's gonna be Oh, so this is his final upgrade, guys. And a total damage of 31.6M and 37.9M flame damage. And then 64.5 range and 5.3 SPA. This is too OP, guys. So this is Overlord. So yes, of course, you must get Overlord, guys, or Avatar. And then much better Glitch. Okay, so he is too OP. And then if you don't have a Overlord, uh, Avatar, and Glitch, you can place... To Escanor or Pride the One. Okay, so he is too OP, guys. Look at that. You must get him. Okay, and then the total cost, guys, of 320k. Okay, expensive, but of course, this is too cheap if you got a businessman and idol. Okay, so okay, guys, that's it. So this is your Pride the One. Yes, the most powerful unit in anime last stand okay guys later